Master Tahaka. My name is Bayek from Siwa. I am indeed Tahaka, Grand Planner of Sais and Steward of Latopolis. I met your family. Your wife sent me here. She said you might know about the one called the Scarab. This is not the place to speak, for who knows who may overhear our words. Come inside and I will answer you. Es ha necheru! Your son is very proud of your work. He misses you. He'll be here soon. I dream of my son and his sons following in my steps. The world is made by great men dreaming big. What do you dream of, Bayek? I do not have the luxury of dreams. Just finding the scarab. The scarab preys upon the weak. There's no threat to me. Are you not afraid of the Scarab Tahaka? It seems after what he did to your father-in-law. What happens to poor Gupa tears me. Whatever my life's work, whatsoever I did to bring that down upon him, I beg the gods forgive me. Master Tahaka! They're attacking the ruins again! Bayek, come fight with me. Sandstorm coming. That keening is the voice of the Resentium. The desert dogs use the storm as a rallying cry. These reavers use the sandstorm to mask their raids. Stay close to me! Do not let these curse surround you! I will not let you destroy my great work! Over here! Drive those naked the attack back! They pour out of the storm! These reavers fly on the wings of the storm! No! 
nothing like this. Crush you under my ears. Uh, 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 Bayek, you fell upon them like Sobek's teeth. Bayek, ride with us. These desert dogs have crossed me for the last time. And with your fierce iron, I know we can end their threat. I understand your thirst for blood, Tahaka. But these bandits are not my concern. Tell me about this scarab before you ride. Is that not the badge of a Medjai that you wear? These reavers are a threat to the good and innocent people of Latopolis. Come with me, Pyek. And once we have returned these curs to the desert they so love, then I will tell you the story you want to hear. All right. I will join your cause for today. Take up your iron and join us! Brave, loyal servants of Latopolis! We will root these weavers out of their holes and spill their blood on the sand! <laughs> this task you have put yourself to, it seems impossible. <laughs> Only the gods can know that for sure, Baek. And if I do not reach for the stars, how will I know how close I can get? Metopolis was a wonder once, before the desert overtook it. I mean to show the world, to show the gods, that men can conquer anything if they put their minds to it. Perhaps you have been sent by the gods to help me realize my vision. A strong arm, a keen eye. We could restore this land to glory. I have my own great work ahead of me. <laughs> we shall see if I cannot convince you. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. to draw attention here. Caged. Please, Neb, if you have any decency in your heart, free me. Stay here. Wait until it is safe and someone will free you. You have my word. Hmm. Sounds like a few bandits are roosting up top.
My thanks to you, Bayek. Before you arrived, I thought my dream was doomed to die. You gave me the strength to hunt down these Reavers. Who are they? Blood-fevered followers of Sekhmet, the Lady of Slaughter. They wish nothing more than chaos and ruin. Are they connected to this Garab? <laughs> no. They think themselves lions, but they are no more than carrion eaters. And now they will feed the scavengers. I will bring this priest back to the city. Meet me at my house. We will dine, and I will tell you what you need to know. May Ta bless you and the protector saving me, Master. How did you end up here? I was kidnapped by these blood-crazed raiders. I thought the road from Memphis to Litopolis was safe. It is now, and I will ensure it stays so. You say you came from Memphis? Memphis is home to many priests. They do not need me there. But Letopolis is fertile ground, planted by your hard work. How are things in Memphis? I must admit, Memphis is under a shadow. The High Priest angered the gods and is cursed to see the doom of the city. Your messengers reached Memphis, singing of your vision of tomorrow. I have come here to serve the gods. Once you are rested, we will make a home for you in Letopolis. Join us for dinner. I'm glad you made it safely, Maharet. <laughs> yes, the gods blessed our passage. We saw vultures and a hyena and so much sand. <laughs> Enough sand to fill a lifetime. That is why we need so many to help us with our great work. And what do you promise them, Tahaka? Parcel of land with a house to call their own. They must only help reclaim it from the desert. That is all? Just dig up your house? It is no simple task. We must all pitch in to honor the gods. People know his vision is a true one. It is good to honor your father, Kawa. The savior of Lotopolis. Let us have some honey dates now. And... Are you all right, Bayek? Are you unwell? Are you unwell? I am failing you. 
Please, don't... hate me. Soon, I will walk the outer darkness with the Hidden One, leading me into the field of Ritz. Stripped of armor, weapons, and coin. Where to begin? Now, to hurry before the wind erases the tracks. First my steel, then the scarab. should have stayed in the shadows.
You won't survive without help! Right here. This is how a dream dies. I could have built something to last an age. And Gupa could have sung stories of your accomplishments. There are things I regret. We all labor for higher powers. We are all enthralled to greater forces. There is no escape. I am but one in the order of ancients. This victory will bring you no peace! It is not peace that I seek. It is not for my soul that I walk this path. The Order of Ancients will remember me as the bringer of waters and the builder of cities! Oh, the desert will blow in and scatter the dream of Metropolis like dust. Take care of him. Try to make him understand if you can. You have brought blood and death to my house. You are blind. But now you must open your eyes. Your husband was a scarab. He did this. Your father was tortured and scarred by this man. As were so many others. No! It is up to you to raise your boy into the light out of the blood and shadows of his father's legacy. I'm sorry, my son. <laughs> 